My last time here in Antigua was six years ago with a different ship, with a different cruise line. And uh, I really found the place to be completely changed for the good. Captain of the Norwegian getaway, Luigi De Angelis, speaking with ABS News on Saturday as the vessel made its inaugural call in St. John's. He explained what has impressed him on this visit. The pier itself, the dredging of the channel, the structure and everything is just shocking what you guys managed to do in six years time. Very, very well done. Thank you very much for that on behalf of Norwegian Cruise Line. He told us why the dredging work has been so crucial. Dredging the harbor is uh, safer for the vest. You have more room for maneuvering. Uh, of course, you, we don't talk about mistake, but there is now room for a little mistake to be allowed and you can recover by having dredged the channel. I understood uh, over 11 meters all around. So that make a big difference for the safe of navigation of the vessel. Unsurprisingly, Tourism and Investment Minister Honorable Charles Fernandez welcomes the captain's comments. I said to him he hasn't seen anything yet because when we go to build out, uh, very shortly we'll be starting on the uh, land side of the fifth pier. And that is going to be, I mean, you know, another uh, exciting um, something for everybody in Antigua because it means a huge expansion, more opportunities for business people in Antigua, more opportunity for vendors, more opportunities for taxi operators, more opportunities for cruise lines to make Antigua uh, premier port of call. I pressed the minister on what more needs to be done regarding the dredging to allow the country to accommodate the largest cruise vessels sailing the oceans. He explained there have been delays from various factors, including the pandemic, hard rock and rough seas, but said progress continues. He says the country will be able to accommodate Oasis-class vessels next year. As it is now, my understanding is we are deep enough to accept the Oasis-class. The issue is that we want and the training base is completed. The issue is we want it wide enough because even before we started the dredging, there was a situation where some ships would come in and it was a very windy day because the channel was narrow. They couldn't come in. 